MTV News has me out here in 10 degree weather in search of a six foot five drag queen in a white limo. And I think I found her. Hey girl, come on in here, it's cold. Let's go shopping, I'm ready. Come on, shopping! <laughs> Describe the RuPaul look. What, it, what is this? I tell you, you know, the RuPaul look is sort of is a uptown call girl. Uptown, hello. It's very, it's glamorous, it's grunge. It's fun, it's now, and it's very accessible. It's very all inviting. And more than just what I'm wearing, it's actually more of an attitude. It's like, you're all welcome to the party, come on in. Everybody is a drag queen. I mean, you're born naked and the rest is drag. In fact, every, every pop star is, I know, Madonna, Garth Brooks, Flavor Flav, everybody is in drag. You're born naked and the rest is drag. And you put on this persona. And actually, there's a way, like I'm doing it, you work you work it to your advantage. Do I call you he or she? Oh, sister girl, you can call me anything you want to. Okay? I really don't, it doesn't matter to me. I mean, like, those kind of labels and stuff are really, you know, it doesn't matter. I'm here, darling, as long as we're together. That's all that matters. <laughs> That's what I'm happy about. Great, we're here. <laughs> Shopping! <laughs> so, okay. Rue, what is your mall philosophy? My mall philosophy is one thing. You better shop. Come on, girl. Really good. Like up against here, like this. How do I look? Who's next? What's your name? Lugo. Yo, 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 Lugo. You could be. You could be the other leg. <laughs> All right. Great. Say sashay. Sashay. We're gonna sashay on into the sand goodies for us some products. What are we looking for, TLC? We're looking for TLC, we're looking for TLC. Yeah, I was mean, doing Revlon commercials when I was five years old in my mother's bedroom, you know? Yes, it's Revlon. I mean, she would catch me with all this makeup on and she'd say, is that makeup on your face, boy? I said, no, just a little tinted moisturizer, mascara, that's all. And what do your parents think about RuPaul 1993 version? They are living for her, okay? I, they love it, you know, I mean, anybody who has Projected an, it, projected an idea or a dream and then have achieved it to do it, that's great. Uh -huh. Yay! You Get better work. <laughs> hey, you guys have this? Everybody say love. Oh. Everybody say love. Oh. Hey, you kids, I have one thing to say. You better work. Hello. Great. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Thank All you, right. TV. Thank you. <laughs> great. You keep saying you gotta work. You what? better work, you, honey. You keep saying you better work. Uh-huh. Exactly what does it mean to work? Working is doing the best you can do at whatever it is you're doing. It's like, you know, you here, it's now, you might as well pay the cost to be the boss. It's my turn, I'm coming out. Who's the boss? Hello. You know, I think after a hard day of shopping, you really do deserve some of those cholesterol <laughs> levels. <laughs> Blockers for the you arteries. You do, I mean, it makes you feel really happy about being alive. But that's what the whole mall is about, it's like, we're here, we're American, we shop. Hey, we gonna get us some fruit shakes. Are you guys expensive? No. I'm on the supermodel diet, so I can't have any fat. Is there fat in fruit? No, not in the yogurt. Not in the yogurt. Okay, I think I wanna get like a fruit type of shake, you Anything know, you like want. really health minded and everything. Of you know? What do you do when people stare? Well, you know, you know, I actually dress up this way so that people will stare, yeah. really. And I love it. I love it. And I think I'm sending out a, a positive energy. And I, I rarely, I never actually have a bad time, mm -hmm. you know. You know, some people might say something or scream something, but they actually, they actually are loving me. Even if they say it's positive or negative, mm -hmm. they actually, and if someone has a problem with it, the problem they have isn't with me. It's actually with what the, the me they see in themselves. Is Middle America ready for you? You know what? Mid America is ready for me, and they're gonna have to be ready for me if they're not ready or not. I mean, what what I am is I'm a result of a change that's happening, and if I don't, if they don't get me, the change is still gonna happen mm -hmm. without, with or without me. Learn how to love yourself, mm -hmm. no matter what, whether you know. And once you do love yourself, you don't have to be putting nobody else down because you're not, yeah. it, you're not threatened by them. Right? I mean, the only people who would ever be threatened by me is someone who doesn't really 
to know themselves or, or doesn't know what's inside of themselves, you know? What's your next big challenge? My next big challenge is world domination. And after that? <laughs> <laughs>